Ripley, where are you? Kratos looked, but his daughter was nowhere to be seen. In the middle of the room sat a graceful figure, a figure he recognized all too well. Persephone, wife of Hades, and queen of the undead. Where is my daughter, witch? Choose your words carefully, ghost of Sparta. You address the goddess of the underworld. Your daughter is well. She lives among the pure souls in the Elysian fields. Lead me to her. Have you forgotten, Kratos? The Olympians need you. They slumber at the hand of Morpheus. I have faithfully served the gods, yet they do not give me what I ask. I grow weary of their demands. The gods on Olympus failed me too, Kratos. I was betrayed by Zeus and tricked by my husband, Hades. Now I am to stay in the underworld as queen of the dead, to serve the fallen and care for them as my own children. Persephone, I demand to see my daughter. As you wish. If Calliope is your true desire, I can help you. But be warned, Ghost of Sparta. The world of man will suffer because of your choice. I care little for the world and its suffering. Where is she? If you are to see your daughter again, you must become worthy of Elysium. Cast your weapons at the Forsaken Tree, and let it release the evils of your past. Only then will you be free of your sins, and be granted passage through divine gates. You have done well, Kratos. Walk through the portal. Calliope! Father? My oh. child. Why did you go? I am here now, child. And I will not leave you again. I have watched over you pathetic mortals for a thousand years. And it is always the same. Serving yourself before the needs of others has always been your flaw. But no matter. For now you serve my purpose. It is time for all that came before to end. The Titan will fulfill his role and finish what I have started. I released Atlas. You? As you were pathetically disarming yourself, Atlas completed the task I set him out to do. With the power of the sun in his hands, it is only a matter of time before he destroys the pillar that holds the world. And Olympus with it. But why? Do you think it was my choice to wed a man I did not love? Live a life I did not choose? I was betrayed by the very gods that once saw me as their own, but no more. Once the pillar is destroyed, the world will revert into chaos. And what is to become of you? I will have my peace and be free from this miserable existence. I will perish, but it is my choice. Father, what's happening? I'm scared. In your selfish choice to be with your daughter, you have caused her ruin. No, 
Elysium falls to Kratos, she will perish. No! I will not let the gods take her from me again! <laughs> The choice was clear to him, yet impossible to make. To stay with his daughter meant the end of the world and the end of her. To stop Persephone and Atlas would mean forsaking his daughter forever. While his hatred and anger for the gods grew ever stronger, he knew there was but one thing to do. Kratos soon realized that what he gained in humanity, he lost in power. Thank <laughs> you.